Beauty for me ultimately portrays or shows in the outside because that's what most people get to see of you. But where it starts and where it blooms is in the inside. And beauty for me is to know who you are and to portray a true version of yourself. I am Madeleine Lees. I am 32 years old. I am a mom of four beautiful kids and I'm full-time at home, enjoying it. When I look in the mirror, I see potential. There's nothing more beautiful for me than realness. To be spontaneous, to be your unique, because there's not another sample out there. My journey to motherhood is quite an amazing one. I never knew kids can change your life like that, so I suppose the most wonderful thing about being a mom is knowing that you get to experience something that's going to last a lifetime, that's going to look different every day, that is just going to amaze you and you feel satisfied because you know you're doing something that is of much worth. With my firstborn, I became a mother instantly. And it was so amazing because it's still me, but me as a mom. And it just made me realize that God already gave me everything I needed. And then we found out two years later we were going to have twins, which was a bit of a shock and laughter at the same time because I just knew in my heart they were going to be twins. I don't know how, but God prepared me. Abby was a bit shocked. <laughs> and then we were blessed with another one. She's six months old. Um, and every day is wonderful because to see them in a combo and to see your husband as a, um, a daddy, that's, that's blessed. That is, that's a blessing. Yeah, so there's a nice harmony. But yeah, it's chaos, but it's beautiful chaos. There was a time that I really let go. It felt like I was in a phase of my life. There wasn't any time for anything not even to speak about sports or even just going to the gym. It felt like I was already gymming at home and every single minute that I had spare was for sleeping. <laughs> you gain weight on places you never knew you could. <laughs> and that makes you think, what is still to come? Is this worth it? And the moment that you become a mom, like I said, it's a switch. That's the day the journey starts. The last time I felt truly beautiful, for me it's in the mornings when I get up before any makeup, before any hairdo or clothes. This is just me. But everything on that makes me more beautiful. And I think I can improve in that department. <laughs> I want to make over as much as the next lady. I think it's just the again the potential. I'm in a very big comfort zone when it gets to makeup and um, just my my whole image and closet. Yeah, so I think it's good to see yourself from a different point of view. Microblading is something to do with this. It's permanent, maybe. <laughs> permanent makeup, I think, is an amazing thing. Be cool. It's permanent. <laughs> Lash extensions is beautiful, but it's not maintainable because it makes your lashes fall out. <laughs> Botox, Ooh, sounds sore. I hear very good things about it, but also Botox gone wrong stories. Yeah impressed me, I don't know. I would like to change my legs. I have some veins on my legs that are blue, it shouldn't be blue. My hair is very, very mousy-like. <laughs> yeah, thicker hair 
more volume. It feels very drippy, easily drippy. My boobs, if it can go back to the way they were, and I don't have the most beautiful toes. But that, I suppose, a pedicure will do, because you can't really change your toes. I think you can't. I don't think you can. <laughs> and I think that is it. Unfortunately, yes, I sometimes compare myself with other women. And that, I find, happens more easily if I'm trying to find myself in someone else. And I find that it's never a good thing because you're not being true to yourself, although it happens very easily. And it's a constant battle. I am many things. I am a mother, wife, daughter and friend. I am a divinely complex woman, a daughter of God's delights. I am worth being celebrated, adored and loved. I am irreplaceable, valuable and inherently worthy, even if I never did anything. I am beautiful. My eyes are kind. My lips ready to encourage or just laugh. My ears are open and receptive and my heart holds to the truth. My body is nourished and strengthened and I walk confidently. I am stronger than I think. I am more than a conqueror. I hold myself to a standard of grace, integrity and authenticity. I speak with certainty. My words are seeds I sow. I am capable of great things, and I run with conviction towards my destiny. And it is bright. I am a woman. I am a perfectly flawed, beautiful work in progress. I am enough. I am my delight.